Okay, guys, I'm going to start over because I had a weak connection. Um, this is Amy with 100 Plus Abandoned Dogs of Everglades, Florida. I'm going to introduce everyone to Kiss Kiss. Kiss Kiss is 14 years of age. Her family brought her to boarding um, 47 days ago, give or take. And she's been sitting in a kennel, and every single day we walk by, we look at her sad, depressed, so thin, and so frail. She's riddled with arthritis. This is absolutely no place for any animal to spend their golden years um, of their life. So we've been communicating with the animal hospital and reaching out to the owner to see what the situation is for Kiss Kiss. Um, we just got off the phone with the owners. Um, and we told them that this is absolutely not fair and it is no life for her to be sitting here the way she is. They have not come to see her in the amount of time that she's been here. Um, they have an outstanding balance that they just paid off for her boarding and we are waiting for owner surrender forms. Um, with all of this being said, today was a day that we had planned for this amazing, beautiful human being named Sandy. Um, who drove literally five hours after many, many mm -hmm. conversations, communication. Sandy, who is this beautiful blonde sitting behind Kiss Kiss. Hi, Sandy. Sandy drove from Fleming Island, and um, she actually came here to adopt Rocky, our little blind sweet little boy that we rescued from the Miami-Dade Animal Services Kill Shelter. And Sandy immediately fell in love with Rocky and literally was so excited to get here and hold him and take him home with her. Unfortunately, Rocky was humping non-stop her two dogs and it was not a good fit. They were growly and we were afraid of what would happen. It was just not a good fit. So we introduced Sandy to Kiss Kiss, um, and we told her her story, and Sandy said, absolutely. I will absolutely give Kiss Kiss a forever loving home so she does not have to live out her days in a kennel any longer. So we have been spending, Sandy has been so patient. Her dogs are in the car with her son, with the air conditioning running. This woman has to drive five hours back, and she's waiting for the owner surrender form and to get everything taken care of with all the paperwork. So I am just at a loss, like how things work out. It's just amazing how she was in this situation at the right place at the right time. I know, Stacy, exactly. Sandy is amazing, amazing. Kiss, kiss, what's happening? Do you know what's going on? Do you know that you have a new mommy and two brothers? Huh? You know you're getting out of the kennel? No more kennels for you? No more kennels. Sandy, you're an angel scent. I don't even think you know what's happening right now, right? Your head is probably spinning. I'm very excited. I'm just so happy to give Kiss Kiss a loving home. I like your shirt. It's just a sweetheart. It was meant to be. It was meant to be. She loves the underdogs. She, she. As a matter of fact, we had a dog come in today off the street, a little cute, little scruffy, soft poodle named Bogart. We named him, and we'll be sharing that. And um, she said, that's my kind of dog, but you know what? I need to save my spot for somebody that really, really needs me. I know he's adoptable. I need to save my spot for somebody that is in desperate need of my help. And that's what she's doing by taking Kiss Kiss home with her. Kiss Kiss is, again, 14 years of age. Look at her bones protruding in the back. She has severe arthritis. We're getting her all set up with all her medications. And she's going to have a nice, cushy bed at Sandy's home. And she has a fenced-in yard. Beautiful, beautiful, loving home. Can you do me the honor? You never see anything bad ever again in your entire life. Kiss, kiss. Jesse's just sitting here like taking it all in because it's so good, right, Jesse? Amazing. What did you say before? Everything happens for a reason. Right? 
Exactly. Rocky was actually Kiss Kiss's savior because without Rocky, Sandy wouldn't be here right now visiting 100 plus. It's just amazing how everything works out the way it's supposed to. So, guys, Rocky is still available. Um, Rocky would do best in a home with no other pets because he's a humper. And uh, <laughs> he just wants to be held all the time, a lap dog. Rocky is our 13-year-old blind little Yorkie Terrier mix that we rescued from the cardboard box brought into Miami-Dade. I don't know. Out of this animal hospital. We have been here for hours trying to get this, put this together so we could get, get her out. This beautiful sweet angel is getting a chance. In her senior golden year, she's not going to end up living in a kennel at the vet's office. It's been breaking our hearts, all of our team. It's been killing us, watching her day in and day out with her sad face and staring at the kennel glass door. So we're going to get everything set. We're going to get her meds together. We hooked her up with some sand. Okay. Let's see if I can get it back. All right, so she's ready to get out of here. I lost my connection for a minute, sorry. But she is so ready to get out of this animal hospital and break out. Oh, mama. Oh, God, this is so good. Kiss Kiss is going to be leaving the kennel, leaving the building, going home with her new amazing mommy, Sandy. Sandy, this is so awesome. It is awesome. Ah! This is awesome. Oh, this is what it's all about right here. I feel like we've aged about 10 years during this process. It's like, I want to play. I want to play. Ah, Jan came back. Because Jan saw her and started crying. I'm so happy for you. Jan, do you want to meet her new mommy? You This was supposed to be Rocky's mom. And now it's Kiss Kiss's mom. Both of you. Is this the best? Jan, how great is Rocky? Rocky was her savior. Yeah, she's a frisky fur at heart, for sure. Is this so great? The best. I. It's so amazing. So amazing. Can't even put it into words. Unless you were actually here, guys, you can't even imagine what this feels like. Good girl, Mama. Good girl, kiss, kiss. Good girl, mama. Look at her. That's right. That's right. Thank you so much. Thank you, God, for all our blessings, for sending people and, and just pointing us in the right direction of what we're supposed to do and guide us through this mission of our journey of rescue. Some days we're just so such at a loss. I was so sad for Rocky, and then all of a sudden this happens, and I know Rocky will find his forever home. There's got to be somebody out there for Rocky. Look at she's got some little discharge coming. Did you just see that? Went to, after she was done peeing. See the discharge? Dr. Clark said he's going to want a minute with her, but he's in a room. I don't know, but you know what, guys? I am so sick and tired of trying to figure out why people do what they do. I'm so, we're all so over it. All I can tell you is that we are so happy and we are so grateful and we're going to focus on the happy and the positive and not worry about why somebody left their dog in a kennel for 47 days, no matter what's going on. Um... You know, I was juggling, we were calling and calling the mother, the daughter, and trying to tell them and show them what, what's going on with their dog and, you know, that this is not fair to her. This is no life for her. And then, of course, the tears started coming, and I just, I'm sorry, I, I just, I, I don't have any space left for that. And my space is dedicated and saved for the dogs and for the good people that, that do the right thing, like Sandy. And all of you and our rescue team that do this day in and day out and see nothing but neglect and sadness and 
we're living in a throwaway society. I mean, I can't tell you how many people came into the animal hospital today while we had Kiss Kiss in the lobby, and they were, like, crying, and they don't even know the dog after we told them the story and how heartbreaking. Jan saw her, and when we told her her story, Jan literally lost it in the lobby and started bawling, and she was trying to figure out a way to get her, take her home herself because she can't take it either. So this is just... Seniors own my heart. That's me, personally. I can't take it. I want to save every senior I possibly can. I want to save every life we possibly can. Sandy is going to give her the best home, and I know Sandy's great with updating because her and I have been communicating, so I know Sandy will be sending us photos and videos of how she's doing, and we can update all of you through her journey. So for whatever time Kiss Kiss has left here with us, it is going to be amazing right mommy are you happy you going home let's do this kiss kiss is going home angel sent sandy we love you sandy thank you again 100 plus abandoned dogs of everglades florida